Hi, I'm Dr. Tim Joshin. Today we're going to demonstrate a punch biopsy. Now, oftentimes, uh, if we have a skin rash where we think that the rash is deep in the tissue, or if we have a mole where we want to get all of the cells, we do a punch biopsy. And first thing we're going to do is we're going to clean off the site with alcohol. And we're going to do this little mole here, which is a little atypical. So we clean up the area, then we inject the area with lidocaine to numb it up. Now the lidocaine does have a little bit of epinephrine, that's to constrict the blood vessels to make it so it doesn't bleed. Now epinephrine is also known as adrenaline, so sometimes it'll make your heart race just a little bit, but we feel it's beneficial to uh, constrict those blood vessels. So you can see it's blanching, so I, I'm quite certain that it's numb at this point, and we always want to check before we do the procedure to minimize discomfort. And do you mind opening these up for me, let's please? Um, let's do the 5 please. Okay. So now we just take this little, it's like, I call it a little cookie punch, cut, cutter type punch. And we put it on the lesion. We twist it. And the skin is then free to come out. So we pull that out. We send this specimen off to the lab and they'll tell us if there's anything unusual about this. Uh, particularly, we're looking to see if there's atypia or a melanoma, because those are serious um, lesions that can be life-threatening. And then after we do that, all we're gonna do is we're gonna put in a stitch. We'll put it in and we'll leave it in there for 10 to 14 days on the body. Now, if we were to do this on the face, it would be seven days. And I do this crosshatch stitch so that it closes nicely. And the idea is to minimize any bunching there so it'll be a nice flat scar. And then go ahead and cut. And then after this, what we'll do is we'll dress it with a little polysporin and put on a Band-Aid. Uh, we'll clean it once or twice a day with soap and water, put on polysporin, and then apply the Band-Aid. And as I mentioned, the suture will come out in um, 10 to 14 days for the body. And what was the discomfort? Minimal. Minimal. Yeah, you barely feel it at all. Yep. Okay. Thank you.